Welcome back to NEMT Van Talks. I'm Jasmine. And I'm Monica. And we're the owners of an NEMT business based in California. Now this video is gonna be a little different. This video has been sponsored by Broda and we are going to explore the fantastic features of the Traversa Transport Chair. Yes, we are. This video is for all of our NEMT providers out there. We're giving you the first hand look of what elevated comfort really means. So stick around as we explore the fantastic features and benefits of the Traversa Chair. Welcome back. We're here with Ed and Ed is with Broda. If you don't know, Broda has been an innovator in wheelchair seating for over 40 years. Ed, I would like you to introduce yourself. Let us know how long you've been with Broda and I'll give you the floor. <laughs> I'm Ed Bandis. I'm the National Account Executive with Broda and I've been with Broda for almost four years now. And we've had the pleasure of developing this new chair that's basically a conglomeration of everything that NEMT providers asked us to put into our chairs as they started using this several years ago. So we're happy to show it to you. Well, I'm super excited yes. and I cannot wait to hop into some of the amazing features that are associated with this chair. So Ed, tell us about this chair. Well, the whole purpose of this chair is to make sure that we can transport somebody not only comfortably, but very safely as well. As we know, most accidents don't happen just because of car crashes. They happen during the transport, the transfer process and basically folks falling out of chairs when they weren't secured properly. We eliminated all of those possibilities wow. and just happened to make it a very comfortable chair so that the operator has a high satisfaction score from their patients and from their customers, as well as keeping the patients safe at all times. Well, I can absolutely say that this chair looks very, very comfortable. Indeed it is. <laughs> so let's hop into some of the features. features. If you could just give us a tour. Sure. So everything on this chair was designed so that one operator could take one person safely, be able to adjust everything on the chair by hand with no tools, and be able to transfer them, transport them, and then take them to where they need to be in a safe and comfortable manner. Okay. Some of the features that we built into that is the ability for the, everything to come off for an easy transfer. Mm -hmm. So for example, being able to take a side bolster off like this, and being able to take the arms off the chair, just like this. Okay. Right. So wow, now we can affect nice. an easy transfer from the side. Wow. If we're transferring from an imaging table or from a bed, then we make it even easier to be able to tilt the chair basically completely <gasps> flat. But even more surprising is being able to raise the chair to the level of the bed or the table manually, oh, wow. 10 and a half inches. Oh, goodness. So we can move somebody to the chair from another surface. How cool wow. is that? Wow. And again, all done without tools and all done real quickly. Now I know that Broda has been an innovator in wheelchair seating for quite some time, but I really, really like how you're able to raise this chair. Mm -hmm. Now, is this a feature that is new? Yes, this is a feature that we built into this chair based on the feedback that we got from all of the operators that have been using Broda's for years in the NEMT community. So we literally took that. They said, we wish we could move people easier from different surfaces. We built this into the chair itself. All of the chair is made with parts and pieces that we've been using in Broda in all of our chairs for decades, literally. So it makes it a very easy transition and low maintenance for the operator as well. Now, I want to try that myself. 
Wow. Wow. Nice and smooth. Yeah. Nice and smooth. Easy. Just like that. And then to raise it back up, you just start pumping on the rear pedal there. The padding itself is actually one of the built-in features that's been brought in from Broda for over 40 years. Underneath this padding is what we call the comfort tension seating system. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna talk about that a little bit more, but essentially what that does is help alleviate pressure points. So if anybody's at risk for pressure injuries, from a clinical perspective, oh. we can help mitigate that. It's not a hard surface. Gotcha. It doesn't uh, hammock out like a standard wheelchair. Mm. It supports the patient everywhere in a very mm. even fashion to help prevent pressure injuries. It, you guys definitely yes. had <laughs> NEMT providers in, in mind they when you created did. this. Yeah. Absolutely. Well, we listened to you, that's why. And we well, appreciate you. that. <laughs> This is a beauty. I really love this. I really love this design. I really love the details that you all put into designing this chair. This is amazing. Now, you know what? I do have a question. What if you have someone that is tall, right? Are you able to adjust this foot plate That's an at excellent all? question. In fact, that's what this whole chair is designed to do is accommodate people of every size up to a 450 pound weight capacity, 20 inch wide chair that can expand to 24. And then from a lengthening process, we can actually use this little handle built in down here and actually adjust wow. down several oh, inches. Nice. So you can comfortably sit somebody in there that's well over six feet tall. Okay. Wow. Now I did hear you mention that you know, if you have someone, a client that's a little wider, that these can actually extend out. Absolutely. Can we share that with our viewers? Of course. In fact, why don't we start with the adjustable arm? Remember how I said we did a quick release? If you notice on the quick release, there's two lines on this post. Mm -hmm. You can expand this chair out to that line and it gives you two extra inches on each side. Wow. So that makes this 20, 20 inch cushion go out to 24 to mm -hmm. accommodate somebody wider. Nice. And if we're looking at the top bolster, remember just like I took this out earlier, mm -hmm. being able to hand adjust and widen this out from behind, just like this. Give them a little bit more shoulder room, a few inches on each side. If you have a shorter stature person, again, you manually raise or lower this oh as necessary. Wow. Nice. And at the same time, not only are we able to recline like I showed you this way, but we're also able to tilt also to make them very comfortable, just like this. So now we have oh, a tilt nice. and a recline feature to make sure that your client is as comfortable as they can be. Now, when it comes to NEMT providers, I think that the tilt feature is wonderful yep. because we have a lot of NEMT providers that do long distance transports. Yes. And this is, like you said in the beginning, elevated comfort elevated at comfort. its finest, yes. for sure. You are traveling in style, comfort, and most importantly, you're safe. Absolutely. Yeah. You're yeah. safe. like. This is amazing. Well, isn't that the goal? Safety? Yeah, yeah safety. We want to keep them safe. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. And comfort is part of that safety. Yeah. yeah. Now, Ed, I do have a question. Yes. Because we have been in and out of hospitals, uh, medical facilities, and even homes, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. So I'm wondering, when you look at this chair, you're thinking, well, how can I maneuver out of some of those tight spaces? Is there any aspect of the chair that can help providers maneuver through tight spaces. Absolutely, I'm glad you asked that because that's one of the neat features that we invented for this chair and it's the ability to be able to spin this chair in place. So being able to pull this handle right here, step on this pedal, you notice that I had two wheels drop down right below. Being able to move it sideways or in circles, whatever is the most convenient to be able to accommodate the location where you are. So Ed, tell us about this board. Ah. When we received our chair, I noticed that there was this board and I really want to know how could this board help NEMT providers with their transports? Absolutely. <laughs> In fact, what's really nice about this particular board right here is that this is commercially available. Anybody could use it, but we found oh. that a lot of our providers 
wanted to use it simply because it's a safe way to transfer somebody from one surface to another. Okay. If you notice, oh. even if the chair is elevated somewhat, you notice that when you start to move, the entire surface moves with the person. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. This helps eliminate any skin issues with somebody who has uh, skin integrity problems, older patients like that that may be at risk for pressure mm. injuries. Mm -hmm. This helps do that, whether you're in this position or even if you're in a completely flat position, it still works equally well oh, being able gotcha. to transfer them from one place to another. Makes right. sense. And you know what I noticed about this board? It's not flat. Most boards are flat. It bends in the middle exactly. here. Tell us we, about that. Well, because we know from experience that sometimes you're transferring somebody from a bed that has to be elevated by their head. Mm. So if you can do a really nice transfer instead of to a flat gurney or something like that, being able to go from a bed that's lifted mm -hmm. to a chair that's lifted, this just makes it so much easier if the board can comply with that as well. Yeah. Got you. Makes and I love how you guys uh, added the compartment back here for it. So yes. it can always be on it hand. It always goes with the chair. Yeah. Exactly. Perfect. All right, Ed. So I want to see how simple it is to put this back together. Let's try it. Go All for right. it. So this chair looks really, really comfortable. Yeah. And yeah. do you guys mind if I act like I'm the client? Like, can Let's you go secure for a me? Ride. Let's, All right, <laughs> sit in it. Cool. First, what we want to do is oh. prepare <laughs> all the seat I'm belt. excited. <laughs> <laughs> so come on in. All right. Have a seat, Miss Archie. Okay. How does this chair feel? It feels fantastic. Are you comfortable? I am. Okay. So now what we want to do is position the seat belts in some place comfortable like this. Okay. Go ahead and get your other one. Okay. Miss Archie, if you could Ms. raise Archie, your arm. Miss Archie, I'm gonna raise your arm. Okay. There you go. We're gonna put this through here. And then you buckle, just like that. Okay. And, and then, then we can tighten the straps here. Absolutely. <gasps> Are you comfortable, Miss Archie? Is that too tight for you? It feels perfect. Okay, perfect. And even here, we can adjust That's these correct. straps. Okay. Just like that. So it's somewhere in the middle of her. Okay. And I still see we have something here. That's correct. This is the required seat belt. Okay. So go ahead and extend that out. Yeah. <gasps> now we're all set to go. You're nice and secured. Can you lift your arm for me? Oh, there you are. Thank you. So, Miss Archie, as we get ready to go, one of the things that I would ask you is, can we put you in a more comfortable position? Absolutely. So, I'm going to start with the tilt function first. All right. And just say, hey, how does this feel right here? Pretty good? <laughs> I am ready to take a nap. Are it. you taking Excellent. a nap? <laughs> I'm ready. I'm ready. Do you feel safe and secure in this chair? I do, I do. Excellent. So at this point, we're gonna be very ready to start moving this chair over to the vehicle. Okay. I'm gonna sit you up just a little bit. Undo the wheel lock. All right, Miss Archie, here we go. It's nice and easy for one operator. I'm all hands off, it's just it. Here we go. Nice and easy. Oh, wow. There we go. And then I'm going to go ahead and put the wheel lock on. Wonderful. And now we're ready to secure the chair in place. Thanks, Ed. This demonstration has been amazing. I think I'm going to take Jasmine for a little ride now. Have fun. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Ed. Bye.